the tunnel, Belfry. It looks like they uncovered some kind of chasm down here. I'm going into it. Comms will probably cut out, but don't worry. I'm a big boy. I'll wait for your update. What is this place? seem to quit.
Whatever they're after down here must be worth a lot to the court. Nothing left here. Something here that has some of the ore in it. Extraction room. Perfect. Okay, but I'm not leaving empty-handed. This equipment must be good for something. I feel like Robin would have loved this. Samples. Probably something in here that'll tell me what they're after.
Dionysia. Someone will have fun studying this at the Belfry. understand your place. We earned our power. We shaped Gotham into the great city she is today. We are the protectors, not you. You're just bats. And I'll devour bats. It's time to go.
Blocked. Probably caved in on the other side. This gets weirder by the second. Here's hoping that's the way out. Are you there, Belfry? We seem to have you back, Nightwing. Are you all right? Always. Found a fun thing while I was down there. Ever heard of something called Dionysium? And Belfry's gone. You take forever to do the simplest of tasks. We have things to discuss. Come find me. The Court of Owls is watching, from inside of Gotham's walls. They lurk in every shadow, and they rule you, one and all. You knew. All along you knew, and you never told Bruce about the threat to Gotham. When I was still part of the League, we observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They're mining something. Something that seems like it might come from a Lazarus pit. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. Guess we know how the Talons are cooked up, then. Thanks for that. But, why leave the court digging? Why not offer them a Lazarus pit? Then control them from the inside. <laughs> Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus Pits. <sighs> you don't treat the Lazarus Pits any different than the court. Oh, those are some harsh words. After all, your friend Jason benefited. What about what he wanted? Jason had no say in what you did to him. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. You don't get to talk about gratitude right now, Talia. With Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. I know you, Talia. You just want us to get rid of the boys so you can do whatever you want. What's your endgame here? I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. Oh, this is how Montoya feels.
guys. Thank you so much for the raid, Elder Drake. Hey, Michael. Hey, Leah. The, uh, the game is actually really fun. Um, I know it's kind of getting shit on in reviews, but, uh, I mean, so far I like it a lot. I've got about 10, 12 hours into it. Uh, there's a lot of, uh, stuff to do. I mean, it's packed full of things. It's got a great crafting system. Um, the combat system is really fluid. Uh, it's it's just good. <laughs> yeah, it's open world. Like you can drive all around Gotham. Um, there's like random crimes that'll go on that you can stop. And, uh, crafting system. I'll show you everything in just a second. Let me just uh, add these new mods. So yeah, um, here's the map of Gotham. So it's got all different sections. A lot of the landmarks that you would expect from Batman game. Uh, you can travel anywhere you can see. Grapple. You have a grappling hook. Glider. The glider doesn't go very far. You're supposed to kind of like bounce off of environments and be able to utilize it a little bit better. But the grappling hook is like the main way I get around or the bat cycle. I can play as anybody. So there's uh, Nightwing, Robin, Red Hood, and Batgirl. You can choose who you want to play as at the uh, like headquarters. Um, and the uh, they all have like different unique abilities. And um, the nice thing is, like, if I'm leveling up Nightwing, I can hop over to Robin or Red Hood or Batgirl, and they'll all be at the same level. Uh, the gear might not be the same. Um, but uh, you can build out each individual tree uh, with the AP or ability points that you get from each level. Um, and like I said, it's uh, like if I'm level 14 on Nightwing, I'm level 14 on everybody. There's, uh, you can equip suits, melee weapon and a ranged weapon. You can craft a, each individual uh, item and even when you like build a suit, if you don't like the, the look of the suit, you can change it, uh, transmog it to a different style. Um, if you do the transmog though, you can't change the individual pieces. So if you build like your current suit though, you can change um, a, a little bit more so you can change some like of the color formats that you unlock throughout your, your playthrough. Um, you can change the style of the cowl symbol and gloves and boots uh, for the suit that you're wearing currently. And the uh, the variety of enemies is pretty pretty good. Um, main villains are interesting. There's uh, like Harley Quinn, Clayface, Mr. Freeze, Penguin. Uh, they make mention of a lot of others. A lot of others. Um, Ra's al Ghul, um, the Court of Owls. So, I mean, it, it's pretty, pretty packed full of content. Um, hidden items all over the city, collectibles. Uh, you have cash, caches that um, Batman left behind. I've been leaving those because they seem to scale based on your level. So I'm probably going to try and grab those at like the end. There's random crimes that go on, go on throughout the city that you can uh, stop and uh, uh, you learn more about uh, different crimes and stuff. Some some of the challenges or the cases that you're working on require you to like kill um, 
specific enemies or interrogate them, stuff like that. So you go around finding the crimes and stopping them to get more information. Um, so it's pretty cool. But yeah, I'll drive around the city just so you can take a look and see everything. Just uh, replying to something real quick. Okay, <laughs> sorry about the ads. Yeah, so far, uh, so far it's pretty good. Um, a lot of people are complaining about like the frame rate. You know what you're doing. Um, it only runs at 30 FPS on consoles. It's not too noticeable uh, when you're playing. I mean, it, it plays just fine and is smooth enough. does stutter, it's very noticeable. Actually, instead of going to the Belfry, I'll just... Is there anything else I need to do? Actually, I don't think so. Might have to go. But every night, uh, you return to the headquarters, like new crimes and stuff are, are there waiting for you to, to stop. You know, get further in with each individual villain. Yeah, you too. Thanks. Thanks so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Hey, Alfred, did the city records turn up anything? They didn't. According you have to a good the city rest permits, there's been no mining in Gotham City since the cauldron was completed. Judging from what we found last night, they've been digging down there for centuries. Hmm. Give this a listen, Alfred. Babs managed to repair some of the court voice recordings. Dionysium brought the Talons back to life. Sort of. Dionysium's basically weak as hell Lazarus pit water. Brings back motor functions, but free will's as good as gone. So, what is a Talon, exactly? Some kind of feral zombie assassin? We've all seen weirder shit. Maybe. Feral zombie? Sounds like Jason, all right. <laughs> I recognize her voice. The older woman is Constance Cobblepot, I'm fairly certain. And the others? More difficult to say. Maybe if I heard them in person. In person? Tim, put the waveforms on the screen. It's hard to find a match with all the damage and voice modulation. Maybe the matching system would have better luck if- We match what we have against the live voices. Fun, but how do we find these jackasses? Two words, Orchard Hotel. The Masquerade. The event of the season. This year's dedicated to Master Bruce. Gotham's rich dress up and pretend they're humanitarians. I've been a few times. So it's Dirtbag Central. 
With so many of Gotham's elite together, security at the Masquerade will be tight. Finding out their plans first would give you an important advantage. I'll tweak our masks to record telescopic audio. If we can get a good vantage point, we may be able to put some faces to these mystery voices. Sounds like our kind of party. a mutual acquaintance. The head of security for the Orchard Hotel, Mr. Hendricks, has agreed to a meeting. The details are pinned to the evidence board. Clayface fell in a turbine when he last fought Batman. How is he still alive? I'm not sure. He was torn to shreds. And yet, here we are. Just getting blended like a smoothie wasn't enough for him. So, what did we learn about our new friend? Well, I've studied Clayface's DNA before, and this is unlike anything I've ever seen. The structure is constantly changing. It's, it's like it can't reassemble itself. We're talking damaged nucleotides, unstable phosphate groupings, and synthesis abnormalities. I mean, abnormal even for Clayface. This sample seems especially disorganized, like, like it's trying to be five things at once. Oh, maybe it's because these pieces of him on their own aren't enough for him to stabilize into a singular conscious entity. <clears throat> you guys are doing your nerd thing again. Sorry. Clayface might be in too many places at once, and he's having trouble being anything because of it. But the more that Clayface comes together, the stronger and smarter he gets. We definitely do not want that. But well, what if he's already conscious? I mean, we can't just leave him like this. Putting him back together could endanger the whole city. We can't take that chance. Either way, it doesn't do us any good if we don't know where he is. The reservoir is connected to the city's aqueduct system. He could be anywhere. There are probably still bits of him in the water, too. It's nice knowing you, Jason. <laughs> He'll be fine. Probably. I'll scan the city for the clay's unique signature. I'll let you all know if I find something. Yeah, have fun with that.
Not good. There are riots like all over Gotham. Well, Dr. Q invites all of her quinners to a wellness party. Wonderful. Throw up the bat signal or something. Let it flush her out. It's Montoya. I don't know what to tell you, Christmas. She's a soccer mom. Just get her in cuffs, man. Hey. Give me a sec. Nightwing, we got something weird down here. Montoya, Harley's instigating these riots. Hold your line. We're coming to you. How many of you bats are on this call? You know what? It doesn't matter. Just hurry. Well, we have a target. Let's knock some heads. 